Sounds like 101 Dalmatians. No, please, please don't go making like reptilian skin coats out of pink Lego frogs. First of all, it would only fit a minifigure. <laughs> you built the white and orange ones there? In my brain, at one point, I think I imagined myself like, I'll build the pink one for spring, and then, you know, in the fall, I'll change to the other one. And that, I'm not doing that. <laughs> just, just being straight with you, I'm not doing that. You might get me to do it with the treehouse when I build that, but otherwise... Probably not going to happen. So, the other day, random things that come up when, when Anita and I are just talking. We're, we're sitting on the bed and we we're just kind of talking and rut row she mentions that she wants a lamp like mine so a few years ago I bought 10 inch tall lamp that had a, a glass cylinder as, as the body and you could open it up and fill it so I obviously I filled it with a bunch of Legos some minifigs a couple little uh, printed tiles so there's like little messages and stuff in there and just out of the blue, she, I want one of those. So we went looking. They no longer sell them. <laughs> There's one. Ah, the mouse, the mouse. I want the mouse. These are really good though, Paul. Thank you for sharing those and, and digging them up for us. Those are really nice. So now I'm on the quest for one of these things from Target. Um, so that that I can make a second one. So that we then will have a pair of matched Lego lamps in our bedroom. But she also made it clear that when it happens, she gets to decide what's in it. She gets to make the minifigs. She gets to pick the bricks. But it's these little random things that pop up every now and then that remind me that even when she says too many Lego, too much Lego, too much stuff, she's into it. <laughs> she's into it. You need a photo of the lamp? I may have one. If not, I'll definitely post one in Discord. I thought I posted one when I made it. She wants to fit. It's just going to be an Aquaman lamp. That's all it's going to be. It's one giant freaking Aquaman minifig lamp. Yeah, Geek, that's exactly the one. Um, the one they have in our store, though, is brass colored. The one I originally built is um, brushed aluminum and I can't find a brushed aluminum if 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 you have a link to the brushed aluminum one I'm I'm all in because otherwise we'd have to buy two and I'm not a fan of like brass brass isn't like it's not my thing so that's kind of the arch I guess That one's black. No, I need... I need the... the. It's it's like it's a clear cylinder, although I guess it kind of looks smoked with a white. Do I have a photo of it? I may have a photo of it. Let me see. Hmm. I thought I did. I thought I had a picture, but I do not. I'll get one. when I, I'll take one tonight when I go downstairs. Hey, there's a lot of Legoland photos here. Um, that's kind of weird. So I'm not seeing it. 
Hmm. Oh, wait, there it is. That's it. And then the just the... The inside is just full of random stuff. And yes, this guy is in there intentionally and deliberately with that expression. <laughs> He's... That, that's not an accident. <laughs> that, that's just me being me. And I... And I put, put her in there with the 60 years of the brick. And a micro dude. Base is thick. <laughs> so I think the new one is a little different. The ones we saw that were, that were brass, they now have a USB charging point in the bottom. So... He's like, who put me in there? Why? Let me out. Exactly. He's a little freaked out to be trapped in a, in a giant glass cylinder. All right, next up, in the things they don't teach you in school, what is the largest amount of money ever won in a lottery? This is... Pro no, no, this, still, this is still current. The largest amount of money ever won in a lottery. And, and to, to pre-rules lawyer this... The amount that was available to the, to win, not, you know, after taxes and they chose the the cash lump payment. It, it's just the largest amount that was available to be won. Just to get it all squared away. In the U.S. Brickgirl says 300 million. Slugbiker says 150 million. Spud, that is exactly what I have. Brush nickel is what I have. 